this was going to be my very first shopping haul video. I had been so crazy over shopping haul videos for quite some time and thought how much fun it would be to have one my own. Clumsy Bee, however, did an entire video talking non-stop and didn't realize my sound cancelling device cancelled not only background noise but my voice too. So here I am dubbing or voicing over my very first shopping haul experience. The reason for this very shopping spree was so that I could try something fun as an item for my want to do list or bucket list of things to do, I don't know, before the end of time or just for a rainy day like this. I can't really hear the sound of the rain here but it was pouring when I got this experience on tape. So about that shopping experience, instead of opting for my usual high street fashion clothing, I decided to try out a couple of regional brands. I have heard of them for years but have never shopped there until this time. So this is usually how I look in my very casual short and crop tops and you know for this video I just wanted to try something out, something out of my comfort zone. I've been so obsessed with pastel colors recently, anything with white, lighter shade of colors, especially pink, purple or light yellow. I've been just really into them recently. So I picked out about four items from each shop. The first shop that I went for was Love Bonito and the other one was Pomelo. They are both very well-known regional brands with great presence in Asia. Love Bonito is a homegrown brand founded in Singapore. Both Love Bonito and Pomelo have stores in Singapore and plenty in other countries. So here it is, my very first look from this shopping haul experience. I paired um, a kimono from Love Bonito with a crop top knitted um, one also from Bluff Bonitos and a pair of embroidered high-waisted shorts. I really like the fabric of the kimono. It actually feels really good against the skin. And I also like how it actually has a belt to tie around my waist. But all three together, I am not entirely sure that I really fancy the kimono that much because it just makes the whole outfit look like it's lounge wear. But I just love like how the crop top and the shorts really fit together to to give this really summery and fun look. Um, yep, I was looking for pockets right there, but you know, even without the pockets, this is actually a really fun and casual and a lovely look for a summer day. So on to my second look. I actually kept the same shorts that I had on from the previous uh, outfit and paired it together with a crop top, another one from Pomelo. So this crop top was actually really nice looking, I would say. I, I like how it was tugging underneath. But the one thing that I didn't like about this top is that the color wasn't as light as I thought it would be. And also it's kind of enhanced um, the underwear a little bit too much. Although I wasn't wearing a nude bra at that time, but I still kind of enhanced the shape a bit. There also some like literary st stripes on the top which look nice but it actually gave me this really like itchy feeling that I'm don't really like on a fabric oh my god I just love love this look I have no idea how it would actually look like on me when I first ordered this because with these really buffy sleeves and this coral color I just thought that it would look really cheesy on me and I actually um, didn't, I wasn't very confident ordering it in but then once I put it on, I mean I just fell in love with the dress, I just fell in love with everything about this dress especially the buckles and the little bow that I can actually tie on my back and it can be really suitable for any occasions like going out with a little bit of fanciness add on to the usual casual day look and also the length of the dress is really suitable it's not too short it's also not um, a midi length 
and with this like really nice uh, waist lines it kind of like accentuates my waist with a cut right there and it's also a little bit stretchy so I mean if I go out on a day that I feel like you know going to it out in this dress I wouldn't feel like it's too tight on my waist and it just fit really nice I actually had a second thought about this dress I went to return it and then decided to buy it again because I just fell in love with this whole look and I thought it looks really really nice if I pair it with a pair of high heels get some like straw hat on and then we can go to like a field of flowers to take some nice pictures and then you'll go on a picnic mm, I mean like kind of like a fancier version of a picnic but yes, I just love it. Okay, so I definitely have to say that this e me look. I mean, out of all the items I have tried so far, this is probably the closest to how I like to dress. I know that I said I wanted to dress, um, I love dressing in denim shorts and crop top but another favorite item in my closet is actually jumpsuit I wear jumpsuits to work I wear jumpsuits when I go out when I go out the jumpsuit is actually like shorter version of my work jumpsuit but I just love a nice looking a pretty jumpsuit on me and this love bonito one just kind of did it does did like a perfect job of bringing it out is actually the length is just nice it looks really flattering on my tummy on my backside and also this have this it has these uh, really nice straps uh, where I can tie some balls on it oh this is actually the previous outfit um, the coral princessy dress also from Love Bonito this is another look of today which again is really really out of my comfort zone this is a off shoulder buffy sleeves a white dress that's really short on me um, I look like I'm just walk out of um, fairy tales but instead of being a princess I'm like a lost princess in a forest or something like that or like someone who probably just pick out a really nice dress that doesn't really suit her probably like the smaller version of herself and put it on having said that I actually really really like this dress when I put it on I like the embroidery on the dress and then it also have like two layers so like the underneath layer can kind of make the dress look a bit more fancy and it doesn't look as I thought at first it would look a bit like cheaper uh, because like this very thin fabric but again, you know, because it's two layers of fabric, um, it just look really nice. It's really princy, sassy, and it's look, I just don't know what the word for it. But I just really, really like this lovely, lovely look on me. I'm just not 100% sure that it will be the look that I will go for when I go out. But for, you know, a fun try out all these clothing items at home on my own, I just love this look. I feel like dancing in it, I feel like I can be so free and I can sway around and I can sing a little piece of music but of course I'm not going to do that but just look how much fun I had wearing this dress I'm just going to recite myself at that exact moment when I tried this outfit on. I have absolutely no clue why I picked this outfit out. It looks horrendous. <laughs> I mean probably because um, it looks a little crumble. Um, I just took it out of the package so it's, it just doesn't look as nice as it should. At first when I ordered this outfit I thought I was going for something a little bit more uh, casual um, a spottier look but also feminine so I picked out this outfit I mean it kind of does a job of um, fitting the criteria uh, those criteria I have for like a spotty feminine look is that even possible to be in the same sentence I don't really like this because it just looks so funny after like trying so many other nice outfits but this one is from Pomelo I mean it's actually 
not so expensive it's about 17 dollars on sales so i kind of feel like it's not too bad if i want to go for something really casual then yes of course i will keep this but for now i just don't feel the need to keep this so this one is another favorite item of mine um this actually is an a lie dress but actually looks much more flattering on me than I actually thought. Uh, I think because of the cut on the waistline, so it's kind of make this uh, dress look a bit more high-waisted and it's kind of accentuates the curves where it should and um, it's actually have the two straps uh, with this really nice pearl buttons on them. The colors of the dress is quite interesting as well. It's like this uh, white background, pinkish with a lot of other colors on it. That is it. This is the end of this shopping haul experience. I have tried on all the outfits that I ordered for this and I just love almost all of them. Especially this jumpsuit from Love Bonitos. I just really in love with I'm just really in love with every single thing about it. The cut, the design, the lovely bow straps and uh, the colors, the fit and just everything and the fabric as well. I also really like the coral princessy dress that I mentioned I had a second thought of and apologies to everyone that had to go through the whole process of refunding me uh, on that dress but I had to order it again. And I really like the first look that I tried on, the crop top from Love Bone Utils and the really nice uh, pair of embroidered shorts from Pomelo. And every other single item that I tried on have been up to my expectations. And yes, I really enjoyed this experience. <laughs>